Do you want one of the hot dogs? You can have a hot, you want a hot dog? Do you want a hot dog, miss? No, you thank can have you. One. That's okay. Go ahead, you can have a hot dog. No, Excuse I don't me, want sir. one. Do you mind passing the lady one of the hot dogs? Uh, I'm you good, to, thanks. You don't have to shoot, you can have your own really here. It's really nice of you, Just I really one. don't. Please. Okay, give me a hot dog. Shall we give her a hot thanks. dog? Thanks. I got, thank I got, you. the big guy can't eat all of them, have one. Uh, have you ever had one before? A hot dog? At the ballpark. I have, I, I believe I have. Okay, good. Thank well, you. Well, enjoy this one. Thanks. Do you like mustard? No, I'm okay. It's much better with a, a topping. Here. I'm just kidding. I'll give you two. Mm. Cheers. We'll share it. Oh, no. I like the hot dog. Oh, no. That's nice. You have a problem with me eating the hot dog guy? Eh? I'm trying to watch the game have a hot dog. I'll smack him in his head. Well, get through the wrong stuff. Hey, you want to go get a drink? No, I'm I'm with somebody. Who, Sorry. The guy with the tucked-in shirt and the visor. <laughs> is that like a brother? The guy was not your brother then. Who is this yeah, guy? Who's brother. this? I'm getting mad now. I'm jealous. Who is this guy? Who are you? I'm, I'm kidding with you. Who's, who's the guy with the tucked-in stuff? Is that a boyfriend? Uh, I, it's just, I'm. Do you think you'll marry him? What? Because I know you've thought about it. The first time you laid eyes on him, you probably thought, huh? I wonder if I could marry this guy in plaid shorts. He tucks his shirt in. No way. And then when you kissed him, you said, I can't believe I had a lot to drink tonight. I'm kissing the tucked in guy. Mm -hmm. My point is, yeah. if you're not going to marry him, and if it's not forever, then you really don't have anything to lose in taking me up on my offer. Uh-huh. Well, I'm going to go. OK. Me too. OK. To where? On well, an ice breaking first date? No, I don't. Listen, I, I, if you want to stay off the market while you're with, I'm not the one, but I'm comfortable, then you can do that. But for all you know, I just offered you a get out of board love for free card with no strings attached. You're crazy. No, I'm not crazy. And, and a lot of times people go, oh, that's crazy. Then they go, it's genius. That's uh, what happened when the person invented fire. They burned that witch. And guess what? Then they got warm and they ate good stuff. And where are we headed to? Let's I'm not make this weird, because I'm not good on dates. No. I better I... just to kind of hang out. And if we don't have fun, I might go my separate way. Okay. I'm not committing anything. I'll, I'll go hang out with you for a little bit. That's not going to happen. I can't say for sure. Mouth, I heard mouth. you. Don't overthink it. Don't overthink it. My mouth. My mouth. I heard keep you. Simple. Well, just keep it simple. And shush. OK, ready? Wait, go. Here we go. We're mind mouthing. We're mind mouthing. Draw faster. It doesn't have to be beautiful. It just shoe, has to be something shoe, we can get. Shoe, 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 shoe. Uh, shoe is so jack. Draw something different. Draw something different. No one's getting it. Was that a smaller shoe? Baby shoe. Smaller shoe. Shoes. Baby shoes. Baby shoes. Smaller shoe. Gum shoe. Smaller shoe. Running Olympics. Look at the shoe. Inside the shoe. A bubble inside the shoe. Lining the shoe. Stop pointing at the shoe. We're not. No one's guessing shoe. Stop pointing at the shoe and draw something different. Draw something different. You got. You got. God damn it! No one's guessing shoe. You drew a big shoe, then a small shoe, and no one got it. You gotta draw something different. Everyone said shoe seven times. It's a sock asshole. You call yourself an artist? Yes. A three-year-old with a box of crayons could do a better job than oh, this. You know, I'm sorry, I don't have the great talent of standing on top of a big red bus and pointing out architecture that other great men have built. Oh, I'm the one who should be sorry, Brooke. I shouldn't well, sit here and pick on your art. No, Because you, you got shouldn't. the nuts part down, okay. Picasso. All you have to do is cut off your freaking ear. Let go, you idiot, and your insults are much more effective when they're accurate. Don't You're talk right. to me about being goddamn accurate. I can't talk to you about anything Because you couldn't even draw You're a sock. Right. You don't do Everyone anything said, right. Everyone said, shoo, shoo, shoo. At first, I, I figured that the split was just something temporary, something that you two would, would work out and get past. But after tonight, I think it's pretty clear that you two genuinely do not want to get back together. There's not a shot in hell. Gary. I'm just. I got you. Uh, as, as your friend and as your realtor, I'm not going to leave here tonight until we decide what to do about this condo, because this living situation is obviously not working. Well, the only logical thing that I can think of um, is for her to move out of the condo and then to pay me some sort of a penalty as compensation for the labor that I did all around the condo. What? 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 Pay you a compensation for your labor? We fixed this place up together. Are you nuts? I fixed it. What, you you nuts, went around I with a sponge, God. and you went in the bathroom, and you dotted foofy shit. That's There's what no you're saying that I did. That was, that's called aesthetics. It warmed this place up so it didn't look like an army barracks, which uh, it was uh, about to. I'll tell you what it's called in his language, depreciated. Uh, that's what it's called. I Unless the next buyer means. happens to have your same Zulu voodoo land taste. All right. And let me tell you something else. It's going to cost money to cover up the holes in the wall. The holes that you drilled in the wall there to hang up, whatever that thing is called. Oh, You're going to have to cost money to fix that. What I did, Brooke, 
have, has concrete value to the condo. I added concrete. Well, let's just go on record. We're dealing with facts here. I did the tiling in the bathroom. Have you seen? I that did the new track lighting. The I did the job. plumbing. The plumbing. That's okay. reality terms. Let's talk about your plumbing. This is this point. We have two temperatures in our bathroom. We get either scalding hot or we get frostbite. That's it. That's all it's we get. It's my problem that she doesn't know how to pace a shower. All of a sudden, that's my fault. I get one fault. minute to take a shower. One minute. One minute of water. Oh, Jesus. That's it. One minute. That's Thank correct. God you're not in charge of keeping all the clocks in Chicago on time. You this are, is basic logic. You are out Let of me your explain mind. this to you, you have lost in plain it. chapter. And cheese and rice, you guys are are gonna kill each other. Now let's just, realistically speaking, neither one of you can afford this mortgage on your own, okay? And that's a shame because this building will continue to increase in value. I get nothing but phone calls about it, all right? Waiting for a unit to open up. So as your realtor, the last thing I would suggest is selling. But as your friend, I, I just, I don't see any other solution. Great, bye. Brooke. Hi. Wow. Uh, oh. It's good to see you. It's good to see you. I'd give you a hug, but my hands are kind of full with all the bags here. <laughs> How you been? I've been really good. How have you been? I've been good. Yeah. You look great. Thank you. The hair's a little different. Looks nice. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You've lost some weight. Well, it's very deceiving, actually. I've managed to become thin without having any real muscle on me whatsoever. <laughs> it's a very tough thing to accomplish, by the way. I'm proud yes. of myself. <laughs> oh, you look terrific. Thanks. I heard your trip went really well. It did. It went really well. Oh, it was good. fun. It was amazing. I saw so many amazing places. It was just... But, you know, you do realize how much you love home. It's good to have you back. Yeah, it's good to be back. And the boat. Congratulations on the boat. Thanks. I'm waiting for it to get warm, and I'm going to come by and take a ride. Well, anytime you want. It'll be on the house. Come on by. Well, I will then. I hope you do. Definitely. Well, I gotta, I'm going to a meeting, so. I gotta drop these bags off anyway, but yeah. uh, it's really good to see you, Brooke. Really good to see you. Shouldn't, I'm sorry. sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying we shouldn't wait so long the next time before we yeah. catch up. We have a lot more to talk about. Yeah. So. I'm good. can see clearly now the rain is gone